Hello and welcome back to Gab Official. Today I'm going to show you how to regas a vehicle. Today we're going to be doing a Renault Kajar. First of all, I'm going to show you the process of doing this. First of all, what you're going to do is, as you can see, this car, the gas that we take is the new gas, it's the one, two, three, four. The first thing I'm going to do is connect both the valves, as you can see, but we're not going to close them as yet. And now we're going to go to the machine, we're going to press auto we're going to go to standard vehicle and we're just going to vacuum it for 15 minutes and it's going to pop say one milliliter of crack oil and put around five milliliters of uv dye just in case there's a leak we'll be able to find it and this vehicle i've already looked it up on auto data and also on this machine it does tell you how much it takes if you actually enter the right vehicle in. This car takes 510. As you can see, and now we're gonna press OK on the machine. You can put in the registration of the vehicle if you like, but we don't really need to. And we're gonna press OK. As you can see. Now the machine's gonna tell us to close both valves. As you can see, so we're gonna close the valves. and see for the process press ok and as you can see now the machine is just doing its thing it's going to do it automatically it's going to vacuum it's going to check for leaks and then it's going to refill the system and tell you if there's any leaks or if everything's all okay as you can see now it's the finishing process as you can see it says on screw both the high pressure and low pressure coupling without disconnecting the AC system. We press OK. As you can see, they're talking about these. So, what you do is unscrew them. Then you press OK. Are you sure? that you have unscrewed the coupling or coupling without removing them? Press yes. As you can see, it's now emptying the pipes. As you can see, emptying hoses, it says. You can see it's going through the checking for leak process to check if there's any leaks in the system before it completes the cycle. Now as you can see it says empty hoses operation complete. As you can see on it says disconnect both the high pressure and the low pressure coupling. Just those two as you can see so now you can just literally push the levers up and they should literally just come off. Thank you and thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and thank you for watching.